Hey, what's up guys? So I was just thinking, right? And a lot of these third degrees are really directed at myself. They help me grow and learn. But I just share them with you all. So I was just thinking about how I, I used to have a big problem. If you guys didn't know, I had a major problem with a lack of patience. Like I just, I couldn't wait for stuff. Like, you know, somebody said, oh, I'll get back to you in 48 hours. Like I'll be itching the whole 48 hours. Like it was just terrible for business. It was terrible for my stress. And I had to really re remind myself that this is not basketball. You all know I'm a basketball player. And in basketball, you have a shot clock, which means, um, you know, when you, you have the ball on offense, you're only allowed to have the ball for a certain amount of time. We got to remind ourselves that in business or really just in life and our growth as a person, there is no shot clock. There's no specific amount of time in which something is supposed to happen. It's only supposed to happen in the length that it's supposed to happen, right? So we can't keep putting a clock on ourselves to where it's just stressing us out. For example, um, I have a, a property that I'm closing on this week um, and the property, it took like three, four months to close. A very frustrating, um, you know, extremely frustrating transaction holistically. But I was scrolling through some old photos yesterday trying to find an old picture and I realized, yo, in just one year, we were able to acquire five properties in only one year. That means from one year since I formed my real estate company and started a real estate company, we have purchased five properties. That's absolutely crazy. But throughout that whole journey, coming up on the end of uh, 2019, going into 2020, I haven't even taken a moment to celebrate. Wow, five whole properties and counting because we have other properties that we're putting offers on nonstop. I didn't even get to celebrate that because each property I'm looking at on a micro level and say, oh man, this one took too long. Oh, this one isn't moving at the pace that I need to move. But at the end of the day, if I'm supposed to close five properties in a year, it's gonna happen. I gotta remove the shot clock. I gotta remove the pressure. No one else is pressuring me. It's just myself. Did my own shot clock that I applied to like, I'm supposed to, you know, close 10 deals in a year or, yo, we have to slow down. Even when, you know, one of my lenders said, yeah, well, we can't do this loan, we gotta do that loan, but after a year, you can refinance. I'm like, a year? What, a whole year? But as I mature in business and in life, I understand that a year is nothing. Five years is nothing for business, for investments. My first business ever just turned five years old, and it's like, man, that seemed like forever. But five years is a short amount of time, and I look silly trying to rush it and make it even shorter. I should have been embracing every small moment of that last five years. But anyway, that's the third degree for today. That's my advice to you all who are in business, who are looking um, to kind of grow and mature. You know, really just in life. I don't even wanna you know, pigeonhole this into business. If you're just looking to mature and find more peace and be happy and not losing your hair like me, um, remove the shot clock from your life. Do things as they come. Be patient, understand that everything has a time and a purpose and it'll come to you um, smooth and stress-free and you'll ultimately live a happier life because nobody is pressuring you but you and if they are if people are pressuring you remove those people from your life right they're not God they're not you no one should pressure you or add a shot clock including yourself remove the shot clock from your life and live a peaceful one peace peaceful one peace whatever peace I need a different word better than peace peace